Fans have been hoping to see a rematch between Manny Pacquiao and Floyd Mayweather for years now, and Manny has confirmed the fight and revealed shocking details on a Floyd rematch. Freddie Roach thinks that a rematch between Floyd and Manny would do well, and he thinks Manny would be able to beat Floyd. Freddie stated, I really think Manny can knock him out. Floyd would be a fight we'd want. I'd like to get that one back one more time. I know we can do much better. We had an injury in that fight, but regardless, we lost a close decision. I know Manny can do much better than that. Floyd's last couple of fights against a kickboxer and whatever the other guy was, Conor McGregor, he wasn't too impressive. I think it's a good time to catch him right now. I do think it could happen, yes, probably not until next year. But the thing is, it is a big fight out there, and again, a fresh Manny with no injuries, I love that fight. Even though Manny's been retired for over two years, Freddie Roach knew that he had been hoping to get another fight book. Um, Pacquiao in the winter. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, Freddie, I appreciate your time. Me and his wife will get mad at me for saying that. <laughs> trying to drag him back out. <laughs> no, cause I, uh, I talked to Manny on the phone, and he, he wants to fight one more time. He wants to fight one more time? He does. Against not an exhibition, a professional fight? He wants a real fight. Who right now, though, could he fight? We have... Uh, I haven't let him choose anyone yet, <laughs> and, but the thing is, but it's just his heart has, he said, he wants one more fight, and, uh, and then his wife calls me up and says, don't let him fight, don't let him fight, and I, I'm, 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 I try to be on her side and so forth, but like when a man in the sport wants to fight, you know, sometimes it's, it's, it's he's going to fight, I, I agree with you, he's going to fight. And you know who? It doesn't matter. Roy Jones Jr. revisited Manny and Floyd's first fight, and he doesn't think that Floyd can really take too much credit for his victory. I wouldn't, I would not be able to take credit for beating Pacquiao after he got knocked out by Marquez because that's not the same Pacquiao. Of course. That's not the Pacquiao at the top of his game. Yeah, of course. But in society today, we'll call that person the best fighter ever. Of course. When that's not how that goes. Mm -hmm. That's not reality. But in business, in the business world, it is because look how much money he made. Floyd Mayweather Sr. has all the confidence possible in his son's abilities, though, and he stated, Man, my son will kick his ass the second, third, fourth, fifth time. Floyd pretty much felt the same way when he talked about a possible rematch, and Floyd stated, I won. I knew I won. I knew I was the better fighter. We fight 10 times, I'm going to win 10 times. We fight 20 times, I'm going to win 20 times. We fight 100 times, I'm going to win 100 times. Manny Pacquiao just is not a better fighter than me, nowhere around the board. He was a beat fighter from round one. He knew it. He knew he couldn't beat Floyd Mayweather. Manny Pacquiao, you're not on my level. You will never be on my level. Period. Simple and plain. It's okay to be number two. It's okay to be right behind me. It's okay. Ricky Haddon definitely thought that a rematch would do well, but he was more concerned about how serious Floyd takes his exhibition matches. Ricky stated, It's very hard to say. Me and Marco had an understanding in that exhibition. We'll make this competitive, but Floyd's exhibitions, he's taking the of everybody. You look at his last fight, he was belittling his opponent and it ended up kicking off and getting a little bit nasty. Do I want to be involved in a circus? I would have more chances of getting it with Manny because he seems like a decent guy. But I'm not saying Floyd isn't a decent guy. I'm only going off what I see in his exhibitions. Bob Arum thought that Manny would do great in a rematch with Floyd though and Bob stated, if that fight happens then it's probably worth it to do because that would be a big, big, big fight. Manny Pacquiao would win now. He got the win against Keith Thurman. He went out on a big note. I would recommend that this is the time for him to hang it up. But listen, he makes his own choices. Miguel Cotto has faced Floyd Mayweather, Manny Pacquiao, and Canelo Alvarez, and he thought that Floyd was better than all of the others. Miguel stated, I think Floyd was the best of the three. He was smarter than everyone else. He was a really good boxer. He did everything about as well as anybody. Manny tried to tell fans that he actually had been in talks to fight Floyd last December, but plans fell through. Manny stated, I'm still active. I'm an active guy. I'm actively training. I have an exhibition match this coming December in Japan. We're working on it, the opponent. 
We're working with Mayweather. Yes, a Mayweather fight. Both Manny and Floyd are dealing with Conor McGregor calling them out, though, and Conor really has his eyes set on Manny. Conor stated, Boxing, boxing, boxing. I've been thinking about it. Boxing right now. One of us in the mixed martial arts sphere is going to have to put a dent in this boxing run. We're going to have to get in, switch the roles, and then it's MMA time. So I feel like I'm the person that can do that. Manny Pacquiao, Turkey Al Sheik, his ex Excellency sat Manny and myself together. We were having a bit of playful banter. There was some discussion. It was close for myself and Manny to box in Saudi Arabia about two or three years ago, that was. And it was real, ongoing negotiations. I'm sure we could pick back up from where we left off. Connor is really unhappy with Manny now, though, and he even brought up the fact that Manny allegedly owes Connor money. How about me versus Manny here in Saudi? Man, How does that sound I, I'm, 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 I'm there to watch now, wouldn't it. You think, now, wouldn't you think Manny should have to come up to my way, considering it's his sport? You know what? Wouldn't you think that's what a man would do versus Money what talk. a mouse would do? Money talk. Money you talk tell him what we're going to say. Well, Manny already owes me $8 million via court of law because he was signed to my management company and then didn't honor his deal. And he was brought under the court of law. And he owes me $8 million, yeah? Even Floyd is more of a fan of Manny than Conor, though, and he has no problem explaining why. Do you genuinely dislike Conor McGregor? Yes. <laughs> yeah, okay. I don't like him at all. <laughs> Does it help you when you don't like the guy you're fighting to train and to be motivated? Um, it really doesn't matter. You know, if the payday there and the fans want to see it, then we're going to make it happen. Did, do you dislike Manny Pacquiao? No, I don't dislike Manny. You don't? Did you dislike him before the fight? No. No. Is there a thing that happens after the fight where you actually start to have an affection for the other guy, where you, you feel like, OK, now, no, I'm not, I don't mean it in a, in a weird way. I mean, like, where you're like, you know, like, I remember being on the playground. Will you make love to Conor McGregor? <laughs> Adrian Broner seemed to know that Floyd and Manny were definitely going to meet each other in the ring, and Adrian stated, they'll fight again. That's why they're doing all this capping. They'll fight again. Floyd gonna be again. It might be worse. Floyd gonna buddy up. Max Kellerman was a much bigger fan of Manny's career than what he's seen from Floyd's. Manny Pacquiao is a better pound for pound fighter than Floyd. I actually Good. disagreed with you. Yeah, I'm surprised that boxing fans, unless you're caping for a guy, uh -huh. this is pretty straightforward. Pacquiao wasn't able to make flyweight. He was a flyweight who won the lineal championship. So if that's not the most or one of the two or three most impressive things in the history of boxing, the fact that he could move up, give me an example of another flyweight who was the lineal champion, moved up, won a bunch of titles in between, and then was that good as a welterweight. Pacquiao won lineal titles, indisputable, that's the man who beat the man, or, or else putting belts together. No one had ever done it before. No one ever came close to dreaming about doing that, and then Pacquiao did it. So the fact that Pacquiao is even competitive with Floyd Mayweather, who's one of the greatest pure boxers ever, do any of us believe that if they were the same size naturally, Floyd would be Pacquiao? While people have criticized Floyd for his exhibition matches, he believes that they're jealous of his smart business plans instead. Floyd stated, They're upset, see? They're upset because I'm smart. I cap all my faculties. I made a lot of smart investments. When great people like Warren Buffett, Bill Gates, the Waltons, the people that own Walmart and Walgreens, when they're getting money in their 50s, 60s, 70s, and even their 80s and 90s, it's okay. A young kid like myself from the inner city, from the ghetto, I worked my way to the top. I was able to leave boxing on my own terms and keep all my faculties and a lot of my money. They're upset that I'm able to go out there and continue to make 40, 50, 60 million dollars outside the ring. You can't get mad. It's what God wanted. As for Manny, he's apologized for the fight not happening when he originally mentioned that it would, and he's announced a new plan for a rematch. Manny stated, I'm ready. Thank you so much for inviting me here again. I'm sorry for the last time we promised we were going to fight. Next year, I hope to see you here in Japan with a big fight against Floyd Mayweather. I thought you didn't want me to say that. I'm excited for that. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe and check out some of our other videos on the screen right now.